wrestling match helped the other wrestler to get up, after he couldn't, because of the little amount of energy he had left. entire volleyball teams went to hug and show love to a fellow injured player at the end of the match and you could see how much that meant to her. A mom filmed her kid trying to talk to her idol via the TV. And in a very heartwarming turn of events, the young fan actually got a chance to meet her idol. A common occurrence in MMA is to hummer punch the opponent after they go to the ground, sometimes even after the opponent is knocked out. But this fighter knew he did some damage and was very wary to punch the opponent in the ground, and he even went to help him. In an amazing moment of peak sportsmanship, the tennis player who lost the match wanted to congratulate the winner, even despite the height difference. Two old teammates showed some mutual respect to each other in the middle of the game. When a young fan received a hockey stick from his idol, he couldn't stop crying with tears of joy. This one is a little bit hard to see, but there's a racer stuck between the ground and the bike, and one of the opponents didn't doubt to help his fellow racer. A basketball player decided to forget about shooting the shot and help prevent his opponent from having a nasty fall. Almost like a gymnast on that play, but Adam stays down. This worried Chinese player went and helped his injured opponent by carrying his staff, and you can see he was actually worried about him. During a college race, one athlete's body was giving up during the race, and that's when two girls from the opposite team decided to help her cross the finish line. What, what a tremendous show of sportsmanship that you've got an athlete who can't quite make it, and they've got a team, a, a girl from another team trying to help her to the finish line so she can finish the race. That's what, that's that's what the sport is all about. During a women's volleyball match, the volleyball went straight to a player's face, and it was very nice to see her teammates and coach going to see if she was okay.
During the state championships, one of the runners' body completely gave up during the race, but she still pushed through to the finish. In an interview afterwards, she revealed the only reason she decided to finish that race is to honor the coach, who was his last season. We just really wanted to um, do well for Jim and leave him the really great last season. A very heartwarming moment was when NBA player James Harden went and sat next to an older fan who happened to be 100 years old. And not only that, he also decided to give her a ball and spend some time chatting with her. During the volleyball match, the volleyball went directly to a player's face, and the first thing the player who threw the ball did was to go see if his opponent was okay. Even though the ball doesn't look like it's going that fast, those volleyballs go extremely fast in professional matches. So much so that in the Olympic Games, the average speed of a volleyball spike for men averages between 70 to 80 miles per hour. And even at high school tournaments, it averages in the 40 to 50 miles per hour range. A young fan was waiting for his favorite tennis player to turn around and see him. Sadly for him, it never happened. And just about when he was about to lose hope, the player came back and gave him his signature. The soccer player saved his opponent from having a nasty fall, 